Hey everyone, I'm Ultima456, you're the Ultimates, and welcome to episode 17 of Lost Platinum God of War Ragnarok. Alright, before we move on, let's quickly read... Uh, I realised actually that I read the one for the Lingbarker, but I didn't read the one for Derlin. Derlin, a minor official at the Dwarven city Nidavellir. At one time, an ally of Faze in an effort to resist Odin. Now he numbs his failures in drink. Yet it appears he has aided us with a map to Tyr's location. Also, his sea creature, Dina, gave Atreus an unusual stone. I really hope I haven't read that one because it seems familiar to me as well. Uh, anything here? Nope. Law markers, I read all those. Beast tree. Pretty confident I read everything for that. Cool. All right, let's see what happens at Sindri's place. A tree house. Lord Tyr. You're really alive. Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. <laughs> I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. Well, I'll be. Yes, boy. <laughs> that was funny. Okay. Wait, why is the trace not talking to me? Oh, I think I have to actually access the thing. Let me just have a quick look around. Yeah, okay. Let's, uh, I have to do this and then he'll talk. he'll talk to me. So, can we talk about what to do next? There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. <laughs> Confer privately with Mimir. Hold still. Much better. Thank you. See? Sleep tight, Tyr. I'm gonna turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tyr. Sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting this settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey! Come see what I got for you. I'm sure we won't be interrupting any goings on. And I'll arrange accommodations. I may need time to construct a bed for someone of your scale. Please, don't go to trouble on my account. Too much space would be unsettling. Do you have a broom closet? Yes, but it's where I keep my brooms. That's all I need. To be honest, it's all I can manage. All right. Um, some food then. Oh, nothing much. Perhaps some hardtack. Hardtack. Any sort of humble ship's biscuit will do. I. With a pinch of salt. Well, I'll see what I can find. <laughs> I've never is hardtack a real thing? I've never heard of hardtack. I could have sworn we had some crackers. Maybe the squirrel took them. The squirrel? Hmm. What are you talking about? Now, uh, where is Atreus? Is he in here? They must be in the pantry. I'll just look quietly. Okay, so Sindri thinks the things are in the pantry. I think Atreus is actually in this room, because he did say something about the pantry. No? Where the hell is he? Okay, I guess Atreus just disappears. Alright, let's talk to Brock real quick. Because that's the room closet there. Oh, wait, yeah, that's our room. That must be Atreus's room, but Sindri's in there at the moment. Let's talk to Brock. Can forge some new stuff for you. So that's what's left of Tyr, huh? Back where I come from, we'd say he's been through a few things. Hmm. So have we all. Well, ain't you philosophical? Well, ain't you philosophical? All right, let's see what we can do. He said he had new things for us, but he's a liar. Uh, he has absolutely nothing new, but uh, that's okay. What do we... we don't have another frozen flame. We can't upgrade the Furious Maul, but let's upgrade the Fortified Frost Knob. I actually end up using this quite a lot. I like its ability. Increasing defense and stagger resistance is always useful. Uh, we can't get these ones any further, and I kind of like that one. The only other one that I do is probably... I don't know, they're all pretty average. Shields. Okay, unfortunately I can't go any higher on the shield as I can't do anything with the rond. I could make the stonewall shield now 
and I might have to, but not just yet. Armor is the same, special items. I still don't want to buy a simple resurrection stone, but I can now sell, well, I could sell it before, but you can sell all the things left behind. <laughs> I got so confused when I read that line the first time, I'm like, what are you talking about? Uh, yeah, unfortunately, can't sell any resources because that stupid glitch, which is really annoying. Got a lot of hack silver though, but I'm going to hold on to it. Uh, let me have a look around the place real quick. I was looking for something particular. No, it doesn't look like it's happened just yet. Maybe it doesn't happen. Okay, let's confer with Mir as, as uh, the game said. See what we have to do now. What are you thinking, brother? thinking I want things to be the way they were well I'd like to climb a tree again certain ships have sailed I just wish Atreus were not so restless I care only for your safety I know brother but Holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, but I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. His pain is fresh. You expect too much. Aye, perhaps. Pity Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. I don't suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I had to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting an old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by not getting yourself murdered. <gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it, though? All right. And welcome to Atreus Gameplay. How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So you know where Frey is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first, and then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? <laughs> It's one of my favorite moments. And then I won't take you to Freya. <laughs> All right, so we can actually play as Atreus in this game, which is awesome. Let's have a look. If we go to his skills, ta-da, we unlock a lot more uh, abilities for him. So let's have a look over here. Rushing Descent. While sprinting, press R1 to perform a leaping attack. That's going to be very useful. So let's go ahead and grab that. Bludgeoning strikes. Press R1 to trip and strike an enemy. Continue holding R1 to deal heavy stun by extending the duration of the beatdown. Breaching bash. While evading, hold forward and press R1 to form a shield strike, dealing high stun. While sprinting, press R2 for a heavy vertical attack that launches enemies. While evading, hold L back and press R1 to jump backwards and shoot a barrage of arrows. I like that one. Looks so cool. Hold R2 to swing the bow for a wide heavy attack. Applies status damage of the currently equipped runic arrow. And finally, high ground. 
Put a powerful heavy attack finisher at the end of the light attack combo. Press R1, 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 R1. I think that was the correct amount of R1s. R2, R2, R2. You can also get Sonic Potency. Sonic Explosions caused by Atreus have an increased area of effect. Sonic Echoes. Attacking enemies afflicted with Atreus' Sonic status creates bigger reverberations applying stun to nearby enemies. And Sonic Explosions caused by Atreus apply Sonic to nearby enemies for Sonic Resonance. Dive into battle. Press triangle to grapple towards an enemy and strike them with force. Apply status damage to the currently equipped Aronic Arrow. Highly effective at closing the gap to mobile enemies. I almost never use this, I don't know why. And Stranglehold, I actually almost had enough to learn this, but you can't, it seems like you can't get enough. I had basically 1704 because this one cost, uh, cost 500. Um, now, I like using this one, I like using high ground. But maybe we should go for something that deals high stun. Maybe this one here, shields or breaching bash and bludgeoning strikes. Let's try those two. Okay, uh, he's got a weapon. He's got a talon bow. Its ability is Hunter's Insight. Increased stun from melee attacks and bow shots. Regular arrows are fired normally. Atreus's bow made out of a yew tree by Atreus's mother. He has finally grown into it. So that's all we have. Bow ability. So we have like a runic attack for Atreus called Stinging Barrage. It deals one pip of damage and two pips of stun. Fires a powerful single shot of several arrows at once that collide with heavy impact. So not too bad. And anything else? Uh, we can change. Oh, we can change back to the survival garb. Okay. I'm going to use the survival garb for a little bit. I, I like I like that that one. Cool. I don't think I've ever seen him wear this one. <laughs> like from this perspective, that is. Okay, let's head back to Midgard. Glad you brought your key of Yggdrasil. I seem to have dashed out without mine. Huh. You got sick of having house guests that fast? What? No. I could just use some fresh air. Is all. Well, I hope you like it cold. Should we swing by your cabin first? Will your furry friend be joining us this time? Uh... No. I, I meant to tell you. Fenrir's dead. Oh. I'm very sorry to hear that. As wolves go, he was always very clean. Thanks. I'd offer to give you a hug, but why traumatize either of us further? <laughs> I absolutely love the conversations that that Sindri and Atreus have. Where the hell's my portal? Game? Portal? Did it appear behind me? Yes, it did. For some reason, it appeared behind me. <laughs> okay, that's like one of the first times that's happened before. Okay, caught a whiff of something awful near the Helheim Tower. Remember how to get there? Yep, just past the Oarsmen. But that's what makes you think Ormengander's nearby. I know what I smell. Okay, well, a lot's kind of happened, and I need answers. <sighs> All right. So let's play as Atreus. We can actually press L2, we get a bow. Basically just fire infinite arrows with R1. Using R2 will have us fire our sonic arrows. And pressing L1 and R1 just like we would with a runic attack will allow us to use stinging barrage. Up down. <laughs> this is cool. The chest. Not so easy, huh? Shut up! I'm surprised he was able to break it with even with the bow. <laughs> okay, nice little puzzle here. So, what's been going on? Sonic arrows consume arrow charges that recharge over time. Mother said I cast a spell when Fenrir died, but I don't know what he's talking about. Accidental magic? That is disquieting. Okay, hop down here. There's a wheel here, but we can't do anything about it. There's a bunch of brambles here. Lift's broken. I'll fix it later. Accidental magic's not all. You sort of turned into a bear. A bear? Including the slobber? Yeah. And I lost control. Frey knows magic better than anyone. She could help me. But not giant magic. Fine. We'll do it your way then, Sin. A huge venomous snake seems much safer. It's... venomous? 
Okay, probably had to cut out a little bit there because I accidentally pulled the earpiece out of my ear violently. And now I can't find the little pip or the little cover. I'll find it eventually. After this. Oh, good more beast scraps and rawhide. And big boy jump. Nice. Alright, regular arrows unlimited. Oops. Knock those two down. Slag deposit there. Shoot the barrel. Yes. Feels good, right? It's great, Sindri. Alright, this is annoying this part because basically there's something that you have to shoot with the sonic arrow there. I wonder if I can do it like this. Nope. Okay. Now, where's the other... There. Let's try going this way first. Hack silver and unfortunately a trace. Way I'm lifting that. Maybe with some help? Don't look at me. Who knows where it's been? <laughs> For block. How'd the arm of tear statue end up here? Find a way through, and I'll tell you. I'm on it. It is soundstone, but the path's still blocked. I don't see any more on this side. Hold on. Let me look around. Maybe I need a different angle. So if you head back down here, now that piece is removed, and you can open it there. Arm. Your father owed for a blood payment, and well, he got it. Wow, great story. <laughs> Anyway, is that likely to happen again? Sudden, uncontrolled, bear rampage? Beats me. We've got company. Got my back? They're literally made of filth. I'm not touching- Who said you need to touch them? I like the way you think. Okay, here goes nothing! Alright, so we got our first fight with a bunch of Draugr. So, let's just try and take these guys on. Not, nothing too challenging. Let's use our stinging barrage. I love the way Atreus just finishes enemies off if they have full stun. Okay. Terrible shot. You can also, yeah, time your parries. Atreus doesn't have like a shield per se. Alright, press X, uh, square to command Sindri to attack. And he threw like a big bomb. Yeah, Sindri can do a bunch of different stuff. So I think that last one was a, a um, Bifrost thing. This last one's level 2, so I gotta be careful. Nice. That was amazing, actually. Oh, throw a sentry. That definitely looked like Bifrost, but he didn't get Bifrosted. Beautiful. Sacrificing so many objects from your bag of tricks. Well, you clearly need the help. Oh, whatever. Okay, more these scraps break over the chest. Now, there's something right there, and there's also some runic words right there, but we can't remove these brambles at the moment, so we have to come back later. Just want to try and have a good look around, scour the ground to make sure that I collected everything. They're just pretty good to do so. I think I can get up there, but not now. I think it's later as well. All right, let's continue. I think the lift switch is broken. You can fix it, can't you? Or does your brother have all the talent after all? 
Depends. Is your father all the muscle? If I say yes, you realize you're confirming Brock has all the talent? There! Let's get going. <laughs> he just had that stored in his bag. Why are you worrying so much today? I just need to look out for the people I care about. It keeps bad things from happening to them. Freya wouldn't kill me. And Jormungandr's probably not even there. Besides, he likes me. He's only eaten me once. I had conveniently scrubbed that from my memory. Well, we're here. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, instant cutscene. Told you he's gone. Well, have you tried calling him? Blowing the horn's the first thing we try. I'm not talking about the horn. Your mute you say That's not weird at all. anything good talk <coughs> ironwood what do you think it means it means we should have stayed home let's head back Frozen lightning? Yep. Want a closer look? No. <laughs> so cool. Yomengander. Let's have a quick read of that. Uh, that is going to be friends. Oh, right. So, yeah. Atreus's codex is not completely filled with the friends and foes for some reason and also combines them how strange anyway jormungandr we haven't seen jormungandr since fimble winter began i was beginning to think he'd left the lake of nine somehow but sindri's nose was right the world serpent woke up when i called but when i asked him about loki and what i should do all he said all he had to say was yarn vether not helpful no idea what iron wood means but it was still nice to see him again all right, cool. Um, I think I'm actually going to make this episode an hour long, but I'm going to take a break right now and I'll continue next time. Oh, I'll continue soon. For now, uh, I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Let's keep going. Door's frozen. Maybe I can. Would you just let me do it? So what was your plan anyway? Just stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and hope Freya's in a good mood? Well, now that I know where she is, yeah, exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck! Don't tell Brock I cursed. He's unbearable when he's smug. Look, Balder tried to kill her. We had no choice. I'm not sure she sees it that way. Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right. Which is exactly why I'm recommending you don't do this. <laughs> I love them discussing this. Okay. Hang bucket number one. Possibly. <laughs> yes. Also got some Draugr here. Just in case that one was alive. Okay, good. Another item here. Ooh. That one's gotta be alive, right? Okay, that one's alive. Come on. Ah, wasn't close enough. <laughs> Oh no you don't. Dang, I love the kick. I didn't even notice that pot over there. <laughs> Until just now. Alright, cool. Four V scraps, let's keep going. It's weird, I don't even remember coming down here. <laughs> this doesn't look familiar at all. Ah, damn it. <laughs> Oh, he threw a poison jar. Oh, that was interesting. He... He leveled up because he did that level up trick. But then he went down again because... But then he went down again because he got poisoned. But his health bar stayed yellow. Hmm, interesting. Oh dear. Just checking, just checking. All right. Maybe this is a sign. Don't be a baby. I'll catch you. Promise not to drop you this time. Hi. Fine. Just step between the realms then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet vessel, I wish it did. Ha! Ah! See? Was that so bad? I sincerely hope I never have to do it again. If that's what you're asking. <sighs> My shop! Well, if I can't stop you, then this is as far as I go. I'm gonna stay and fix this. Suit yourself. <laughs> Pulls out giant broom. Alright, let's get out of here. So begins a rather large section for Atreus. See if we can get through it. Alright, there seems to be some sonic stone behind there. Yeah, but can't get there yet. You sure you want to go in there wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. You need a murder weapon to be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? When it leads you to believe you can convince Freya of anything, yes, it is. I have to try. Well, uh, just keep going. Okay, barrel right there. It's pretty straightforward, this bit, just linear. I'm just having a good look around. 
love looking at the design. Are you sure this is a good idea? You haven't got a plan. Brock says some people run better on chaos. I think he's right. What makes you think that applies here? This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing and we're out of options. Living. Living is an option. I love that. And this is Ragnarok. <laughs> Very meta. Uh, spin. Enter. Okay. Now which way to the council? As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Yeah. Sounds right. Yeah, so if you don't remember in the first game, towards the very end, there was a secret area known as the Council of the Valkyries. That's where we're trying to go right now. Okay, anything else here? Mm, no, let's shoot this bat. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, ah, this one's alive. Hang on. You can tell because the ray cool turned uh, red. Was I too short to be hit by that? Those are a lot easier to combo when you're, you're just attacking with m melee attacks. Uh, okay, so it should be fine. Wait. It's weird that they only... Okay, well that one is faking it. Ah. Go. <laughs> Beautiful. Actually worked out rather well. Perfect parries, you can get something from them, but not right now. Later on, we will, we will be able to. Did I miss? I feel like I missed something. Hang on. Ah, oh, the pot. Okay. Nice. Alright. More soundstone. Um... All right, so soundstone, and then I like this one actually. I think it's like jump in here. No, hang on. Jump back. First, it's like that. It takes care of that. Then it's like this. Ow! <laughs> Just explaining how easy it was to dodge you, and then you go and hit me. Good. And thanks for the health too. Oh, that was a good amount of health. All right, so now I need to explode that one, and then I can get through this way. So what? Hang on. Oh, okay. So this is the secret, yeah. But it is possible to miss this chest. And I feel like it would be quite easy to do so as well. have to hide things if he just trusts me. How can I trust you if you lie? Actually, that's a good point. <laughs> Maybe if you listen to me, could I not say the same? Well, where do you think I learned it from? <laughs> oh, I thought that was... Oh, I was like, what was he asking? Ah. Oh, you. Yeah. Alright, let me deal with you first. One annoying thing about Atreus' gameplay is that it's pretty... Oh, hang on, what am I doing? Take this. Take this. It's pretty, like, samey, for the most part. At least for the early part of the game. And then... Later on, I think it starts to become a bit more exciting. Uh, okay, we have a problem here. Wait, did that guy not die? How? Okay, well, I kind of deserve that. <laughs> I got I got a little bit confused about what the hell happened there. I should probably check my skills before I continue. Hang on a sec. Uh, nope, I shouldn't. 
because I got nothing. Okay, I don't know why he didn't die before. Maybe I just didn't kill him. Yeah, have some of this. There we go. Next. So I think if I hit them in the head... Oh, it was a different guy. And there's another one. <laughs> My goodness, okay. Um, how am I going to get out of this? Okay, so this guy is no longer reacting. That was nice. Alright, let's at least try and survive. I can't see. <laughs> I couldn't move behind me. Uh, uh, no. Couldn't move and I thought there was an enemy behind me, so that's what threw me off there. Alright, we can do this. Ow, stop hitting me. Holy, knocking back. There we go, that was pretty good. So, R2, R2, R1. Okay, there we go. Now I'm learning. Where's the other guy? Do that. R2. Two. Get out of here. Oh my goodness, I can't fight these guys. There's too many of them. Okay, good. So glad that he was the one that dropped the uh, health pot. I don't remember this fight being that hard. Is annoying. <laughs> I mean, they are dying, it's just it's taking a while. Come on, geez, that was so close. Alright, one's down. Okay, here we go. At least you get out of here. Seriously? No! Oh, come on! I waited just slightly too long for the perfect headshot. Ah, why is this so difficult? <laughs> I remember I had a, I did struggle with a few, with a few Atreus fights, but I didn't expect this much struggle. Just die already! Come on. Perfect. That's what I want. Yes, thank you. What in the hell happened there? <laughs> okay, good. Okay, R2, R2. That's your, that's your ticket to winning. Get out of here. R2, R2. Where's the other guy? Alright, well, aren't you glad I figured this fight out for you? <laughs> I think I'm glad that I figured it out for myself as well. <laughs> Just press R2, R2. Um, Alright, that's annoying that I used up a little bunch of time there, but... We'll keep it going. Why don't you trust her? Why won't you tell me? Um... Ah, I was like, where do I have to go? Here. <laughs> now there was something... What was it? There was something about... Ah, oh, right, I think I remember. Let's see. So it might be here. When you enter this place here, don't go, don't run. Just prepare an arrow. Pretty sure it's here. Yep. For exactly that reason. And they, and they still almost both, both got me. Uh, I think I'm supposed to go this way. Oh yeah, there's a... Nice little hanging bucket there. Where's that one drop? I think it drops on the other side. 
Yeah, it drops all the way over there. Now, which is the dead end? Oh, that's right, yeah, it's actually a trick you can do. Uh, well, not really a trick, but part of the game mechanics. Uh, and I don't think I can do it. Hmm. If you press R3, you should be able to spin Atreus in the direction of the... Okay, cool, I went the right way. In the direction of the main quest. So if you want to know which way is the main quest, you press that, and then you just go the other way if you're looking to, like, 100% things. But... Oh, that's weird. <laughs> but for some reason, it doesn't work right now. Come back, Stantler. I'm going to catch you with my Pokeball. <laughs> uh, let's go over here. Axel 100. All right, that one's red. Die. Die. Headshots do more damage and probably more stun. But right now it's not enough. <laughs> okay, was it... No, I was gonna say, was it here? No, it's the wrong way. It would be... around on that side. If I don't die, I can collect it. Guess I'm going the right way. Really wish I had a compass. <laughs> well, there you go. Speak of the devil. Uh, okay, so we're heading in the direction of Freya. She's over there. So, let's keep it going. Oh god, okay, more nightmares. Thankfully these ones are kind enough to give me a second. Beautiful, there we go. I actually like aiming and, and dodging out of the way is pretty cool. I don't use it that much, but I love how they got... Oh wow, that's actually a different animation there. Yeah, he like his legs are in a different position. That's so cool. Was it here? No, this can't be the one because there's a chest there that was not there before. Nice, another nice. <laughs> Let's see. I think it's over here to the right. I thought that was, it must be this. Yeah, it was this one. So what was in it? Fifty-eight hacks over. That's not too bad. All right. Let's do another fight. Okay, you can shield slam them. This guy's alive, so do that. Like that. That guy's alive too, so hit that. Whoa. One. Nope. Smack. Now R2. There we go. Oh, hang on. That was actually pretty good. Can I see that again? Shield. Well, that sucked. Well, with you, it's gonna work. Hang on. But I wanna try with you. Yep. Okay, that did not work. I wonder if it works on a parry. It probably works on a parry. Come on. Oh good, uh, uh, you're a normal guy. I mean, you're a magic dude, whatever. Yeah, the other thing about Atreus is you don't have to use specific abil- well... Yeah, you don't have to use specific abilities to, like, work on specific abilities, so you can pretty much just use the combos that you want to use. And I have discovered that knocking enemies off the edge is pretty much the quickest way to get it done. I'm actually trying to figure out where the hell that chest was that I was looking through the gap. I'm sure I'm still heading towards it, but... Also felt like it wasn't the case. Okay, explode that. Yeah, very straightforward section with the Atreus here. More psych deposits, more beast scraps. Getting a lot of beast scraps, which is really good, it'll come in handy later. Ooh, well, ooh. <laughs> how did that last one not get me, man? Right? Yeah, I got this. What is this? This is a is a monster of some kind. Is it one of the ones that we defeated in the previous game? Kind of feels like it could be. 
What was the one we fought here? Wasn't there like a dragon that we fought near here? It was... It starts with H. I don't think it's Christ Velger, I don't think it's that one. Pretty sure it started with H. Or D, you could have started with the letter D as well. Hmm. Uh, okay, so you can use that and that, but you don't need to. Let's get going. Where are we going for time? 15 minutes, I think. Uh, there's the chest, okay, cool. Beautiful, there's a chest, there's a gap, and we're pretty much almost there. I hope I can complete this in an hour. <laughs> this episode, or oh, this part. Hello down there. Hey! Come to your senses yet? Yes, I mean, uh, I'm not changing my mind. Ha! You do have doubts! During my practice, I threw this. I'm going to drop it this time. Like you never do? Better than having regrets. I'm not sure I agree with that, but by all means, keep going and you might find those too. Okay, nothing different happened. If you throw it, he just gets annoyed at you. That's the door. And I just feel like that's a mean thing to do. Just be sure to scream if she starts killing you. <laughs> Thanks. I feel so much better now. All right, so yeah, we would just Pretty much directly below where we needed to be, but we had to go around that whole section just to get here. Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? I mean, just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean. Okay, yeah. She probably avoid mentioning that. <laughs> Is that Freya? Am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. Uh, I'm so dead. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Why would he do that? This is supposed to be like the idiocy of youth. <laughs> but he's not. He's not that dumb. All right, here we go. Take your life on it. <clears throat> what do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father to save your breath. His fate is sealed. Well, you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin. <sighs> nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us. Offered peace if we don't move against him. <laughs> Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Girl's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No, I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. In Jotunheim, 
You learn the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And and that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They know me as Loki. I think maybe I'm supposed to help stop Odin somehow. But since all the giants are dead and you won't fight Odin, then you've already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from whole! Okay. Okay. But we found here. Maybe if you spoke to him. Here is alive? Yeah. We we broke him out of Swartal Farm. Impossible. The nine realms are closed to all. No. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together. Enough. Enough! <laughs> Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. All right. <laughs> Well, Freya is big mad. Let's read the codex entry. Actually, this might be a bit different. Well, our chat wasn't all I hoped for, but it actually could have gone much worse. At least now I know she doesn't want to kill me. Not really. She seemed interested to learn about Odin visiting and Tyr being alive and me being the last giant, and especially about realm travel being unlocked. Really not sure what she's going to do next, but hopefully it won't be using all the information I just gave her to attack us again. Yeah, I really didn't think this through. <laughs> uh, so good. All right, cool. We have about, what is this, eight minutes? Yeah, about eight minutes left. So hopefully I can finish this off. Yeah, let's collect this unmissable legendary chest for Atreus. It is an accessory called Sonic Aftershock. Scraps of metal from Tears Temple fused with soundstone echoing the warrior spirit. Let's have a look at that accessory. So we've got an armor. I'm going to change back to the Brothers Band brand vestment. I'm going to try and use as much armor as I can in the, uh, in the videos. So this is an item that we can equip and, equip and it gives you different abilities. Melee attacks against an enemy afflicted with Sonic deal bonus stun. Upgrade increases the stun dealt. So let's uh, activate that. So basically we want to hit the enemies with sonic and then just hit them with melee attacks to increase stun damage let's grab this and now let's try and get out of here quickly okay so i'm not dead i didn't get any answers so this all might have just been a very big waste of time which i will never ever admit this injury <laughs> Uh, jump and climb down. Yeah, I like climbing. Now, where are we going next? That is actually a spot for later. Let's go in here. We can collect this. Jump. Oh, thank you, Mir. You're all right. How did it go? I'm starting to think. Sindri, I told you I could handle it. But I don't think she's going to help us. Okay, so we broke open that shortcut from earlier. Alright, let's try using the smithing shop. Uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh! I was thinking and I, uh, got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh... Today was your lucky day. So, tell me, how did it feel to run on chaos? I... I just fixed that! <laughs> Jerk. Okay, so let's try. So 
So for this one, we pretty much have to... Ow. Pretty much have to deal stun to this guy. Oh god. Ah, oh, come on, game! <laughs> I was so close. I saw the other enemies, but I was like, let me get rid of this guy, please. Alright, let's try that again. Take this. Take this. And I thought I pressed it in time, but apparently not. There we go. Come on, Sindri. Another one. Oh my goodness. The pain. There we go. Oh, that was a nightmare. Look at this. Beautiful. Look right, at this guy. Beautiful. Poison. Huh. Huh. One, two, three, four. Alright, we got through it. <laughs> I'll repair it later. Let's get out of here before something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way. He'd kill you. Right. Well, speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. Okay. I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Come on, Sindri. Speak up. That's how you get back down here. Did I ever quit? Beautiful. Something behind me. Ah! Nice, good dodge. You can try and dodge him like this, but I don't like to do that because. Nice. <laughs> Froze the, the ice of nightmare. Okay. You were saying? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. What an interesting, like, side story to bring up. Like, that's only something that could happen in a video game. <laughs> Okay, if they're level 2, they can't be lifted, I think. 1, 2, 3. Interesting. <laughs> He's just carrying. Here, throw it. <laughs> anyway, you did a good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. What do you mean, a choice? I... I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night. Trey. Trey? It's an... Shut up. <laughs> uh, it's a nickname. I love that. It's it's a great piece of storytelling to give uh, Sindri and Brock. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. <laughs> nope, that was worse. <laughs> and I heard it when I said it. <laughs> brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Shall we? Yes, we're pretty much at the end of this, so I'm just going to go back to where I need to go, and we're in the episode. 
I hate coming home empty handed. After Tyr was such a failure, just wanted now to. Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure? You saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe. But father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there, I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. <laughs> yeah, I was like, where's the damn door? I don't want to screw this up again. Go, go, go. All right. We will go, go, go. But we will go, go, go next time. For now, I want to thank you all for watching episode 17 of Lost Platinum God of War Ragnarok. My name's Ultima456, you're the Ultimates. Sorry, I'm talking like that. I'm trying to think of, think of what I'm saying before I say it. You're the Ultimates, and I'll see you next time.